Good afternoon, YouTube. Welcome back to another episode of JV Home. Wait, hashtag JV Home. I look a hot mess because I went out last night for my friend's birthday and I'm back to start the kitchen. Woo! Moment of truth. Yeah. That looks so cool. Oh my gosh, it looks like a kitchen. Good evening, night guys. I just woke up from the longest nap. Well, I needed to sleep. I hadn't slept since going out, so this is the kitchen so far. My first cupboard and the second one. And that's dad. <laughs> So I have finally been able to cook in my new kitchen, although it's not completed. I've got cupboards up and I've got pots and pans and a cooker. And I made my signature meal, which is Jamaican curry chicken rice. And I had roti as well. So there's the rice. I completely forgot to show you guys the process. Also, I bought these today um, from the bargain shop down the road. I thought they were just really cute for now. And you also get another matching one, which is really, really cute. Guys, the first dish wash is complete. And I have to say, this is really exciting to me. There are no watermarks on my glasses. Ooh, yeah, second day pizza. So I'm back. I want to show you guys this top, right? Because it's so cool. I got it in the cell. Oops, let's just hide that. I got it in the cell yesterday in Zara and it was like five pounds. But today's an errands day. So I'm just going to take this off. But I just wanted to show you guys this top is like, I'm just like really feeling it. As you can see, my kitchen is kind of done. It's functional. I have a hob. Um, I haven't changed my worktop yet. I am painting it and this is the paint. I know no one's ever heard of people painting a worktop. However, my worktop is solid wood and I'm gonna gloss it and just seal it. It's gonna look so good. So I might start that tomorrow actually. So this is the kitchen. The oven is done. The microwave is hidden inside here because I plan not to use the microwave very often because of course microwaves are not very safe and the rays that come out so I'm quite happy of where it is and that it's hidden. Oh my gosh, these hobs get dusty so quickly and I've got blinds, yay! So I'm officially a person who has privacy in her own home. This is my third week going on fourth week being in the flat and I have not had anything up on this window for the whole time. So it's nice to have some sort of privacy and I can still peek out and you know, neighborhood watch and stuff. I like to have the air, the light come in without having the whole world look in. Even though I'm like on the second floor, which is the top floor in my building, um, and no one can see anything, like just trees. I need to get a bike lock. Now, I have a bike downstairs in my storage cupboard. The funny thing about this bike right is I've had the bike as long as I've had Rich. Rich is turning eight in December, and I can count the amount of times that I have actually ridden this bike, because when I actually got it, and when I got Richie, I was at home for about a year or two, and then I went off to uni, and so I didn't take the bike or the dog with me, and then when I came back from uni, I didn't go back home, I was like Miss Independent, so I ended up moving and staying at my aunt's for two years, and then I bought my flat and now I'm here. So that's just a bit of background. So I haven't had my bike, I haven't had my dog in ages, so I can't wait to have him for two weeks. I mean, my mom tends to go on a few holidays every year and I always just babysit him, but I usually go to hers and babysit him, dog sit him, but this time he's coming to mine and he's gonna love it. I know he's not gonna wanna leave. And the sun's just coming out and it's so beautiful. I need to like invest in some tripods and stuff so that I can like, and then wash up and talk to you guys. It's a bit angled. I say wash up and talk to you guys, right? So I forgot that I had a dishwasher down there and I had loads of dishes stacked up in this sink today and I was literally about to like, you know, start washing up and then I thought, what is my dishwasher there for? I don't know, because it's just me, I feel like I'm never gonna have loads of dishes to do a dishwash. The only time I've used a dishwasher, which was once, which is when I first got it and I just put all of my sets of dishes, which are in here, so that they had a nice fresh rinse. 
but I don't think I'll ever, ever, ever have loads of dishes again to use the dishwasher, but so I'm just gonna pile it, maybe like two days worth of things, not too much because, yeah, even though I have so many dishes for one person, these ugly yellow lights are really, really pissing me off. Um, those will probably be the next thing to get done in this kitchen. Well, that needs to be painted. Yeah, so far, so good. I can't find any cute, pretty ornaments to like stack up in these places. So I bought this frame for that picture and I do not think that picture is gonna fit in that frame. Also, oh yeah, I haven't got my headboard yet, but blah, that's a long story. The guy that was meant to make it made the totally wrong thing. And I was like, I did not ask you to make that. And then he was like, well, do you want it or not? And I was like, no. So now I'm back to square one, like three weeks later, looking for a new headboard. Echo, I'm in my living room, which is empty and white and bright. I love it. But yeah, I just went a little shopping happy in HomeSense and I got some things. I got a few things for Rich, but I didn't get to get his bed. I also got a really cool bike lock, if a bike lock can be cool. And I wanna go and try and test out my bike and try and lock it. This is the bike lock that I've like ripped apart. <laughs> some yellow rubber gloves and I am going to clean the bike. I like putting grapes or any kind of fruit in my wine. He loves me, he loves me not. He loves me. I definitely need like a wok that can just fry this stuff up real quick. But I think this is doing all right for now. It smells good. Um, I'm gonna add some seasoning and also my spinach over there. Okay, so I found this Blue Dragon stir fry sauce. So I'm gonna add a little bit because I think this is way too much. I don't want it to be like slippery. I just want it to have a hint of flavor. This is my dinner, my salmon broke, that's annoying, but it still looks very yummy. Of course, as I said, I'm Caribbean, so I have to have the avocado with everything. Um, so this just happened. I am painting the worktop finally. I have no boiler, so I have no hot water. And I have no heating for today and a bit of tomorrow. Look at these rose goldy copper pipes. If they could leave some of these for me, I'm sure I could figure out something to do with it because I'm having some rose gold features in the house because I just think it looks so nice with white and grey. My dad is bringing my washing machine today so that space will be filled. Bittersweet though because I've been putting a stool here, putting my laptop up there, having my dinner and eating. That's been like my little dining table for the past week. This was my kitchen before. Day number two. So I didn't get to steal any of the pipes because as you can see, there's four there. There are some here, which I don't know if he's gonna use. So this is the new boiler. It's newer and it's nicer, but it's huge. So it's taken up like all of my cupboard space so remember i had like shelving here which you kind of use as like an airing cupboard and put like um towels and stuff well i can't do that anymore i may try and do something maybe on top i don't know i want to show you guys something because i'm actually like stressing out over my wardrobe office youtube space it hasn't changed since i moved in and i just don't know what to do with it right now so i need your help i think i want to keep this chest over there obviously i'll move it along a bit so it's like kind of a bit more directly underneath the window i'm gonna move it probably to the corner because what i'm thinking to do is on that wall and along that wall i hope i'm like showing you guys properly so along those two walls have and um, be like ikea shelving units for shoes and bags keeping the um heater cover there because it's quite cute but i'm thinking to do like shelving or something there i don't know this is an old wardrobe which i was thinking to paint um but now i don't know if i'm just gonna go i'm gonna just buy a new white wardrobe i w originally wanted like a four door one so it'd probably come to like there but it's just gonna take up loads of room and then of course the white desk in my bedroom now is gonna be here with the collage and stuff like that so somewhere in that room i need to fit like a small sofa bed for guests and anyone that's coming to stay. And I think my room is like perfect for selfies. I had this idea today after watching a few house tour videos and also just researching some interior stuff. 
and I'm gonna show you guys because I'm planning something that could be quite hit and miss but I want to know your opinion I'm gonna have a headboard which is gonna come to like there or something and so what I've decided while well, thinking about doing is putting some mirrors like there on each side of the bedside table so it'll be a mirror directly like a rectangle one there remember it won't look crazy because I've got a headboard as well and I've been seeing this a lot and I know those are already mirrored I know guys but I think it will just make my bedroom look really like a master bedroom which is what I'm going for and so I want to know what you guys think what do you think about adding the extra mirrors over there because I think that it will be really really cool so yeah I'm trying to decide what to do I mean to be honest this room I'm not really gonna touch for now until I get other stuff done in the house I think my phone's ringing I'll be right back I didn't actually show you guys this pretty cushion did I I think I kept saying I'm gonna show you what I bought show you what I bought I didn't buy that much I should probably show you now right okay let me show you now, I'll be right back. I will literally be right back. So I bought this the other day. It's like a box. Hello. And um, yeah, I can. I mean, it can go on a dressing table. It can go on a little tray with flowers next to it. I don't know yet. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I didn't fill it up, thank God. I got this, which I think is super cute. Um, it's one of those things, so I had to fill it up and um, these sticks come out. Mm, that smells good and then you just kind of turn them around and I can fill it up more because they gave me more than enough liquid smelly stuff inside I got this um I've been burning candles in there as you can see so it's just one of these things that are like super popular at the moment um I just thought it was cute to put a little tea light in there and burn that because I burn candles every day and yes that is me that is baby jade I think I was about two I went to a private school and I wore a uniform and a blazer and that was about five or six pounds from HomeSense. So guys, I have been rambling on for approximately 20 minutes now and um, I'm supposed to be filming. I don't know if I'm gonna film today. Thank you so much for all the love on my first JV Home video. The love was amazing. The views, the comments, the likes, the shares. You know, people messaging me about it. Your input is what I want. And I'm asking you guys, what do you think about the mirrors on the walls in my room, by the bedside tables? What do you think about the furniture and positioning in my wardrobe room? Hashtag JV Home. And write in the comments down below. And like, subscribe, share with somebody.